All right, got the win to even the series today. It looked like even after the loss yesterday, the guys weren't rattled. They came out swinging really well in the first few innings. What did you see from the lineup to start the day? Well, as much as you hate to admit it, Justin Campbell was that good yesterday. I hate to admit it. Four pitches for strikes. Great change up to no fire left-hand hitters. So it was a challenge. You know, we, we've been there before. We Hanson kicked our butt one Friday night, and we came back that next Saturday against Stevens and had a good day and had 12 hits. Obviously, we came out really good and put huge pressure on them, and we just – we had the one inning first and third where uh, Bishop strikes out without getting the bat off his shoulder, and then it sort of spiraled. Martin came in, did a great job, and just threw fastballs by us. And, but obviously, we, we can't be too choosy on wins, so we'll take the wins. But it was tough. Look tough to, to go that many zeros in a row. But um, our guys are resilient. They come to play, and the pitchers were, were outstanding today. And so that was awesome. It looked like uh, Marcelo was much more efficient today, yeah, too, from he, his he, start. He was great. He did a fantastic job. Marcelo got us put into the sixth inning and he was outstanding the pitching and our bullpen's been really good for a while now so it was awesome for those guys to come in and do a good job. Warriors homer last night he hits a three-run bomb today that pretty much won the game for you guys. Yeah that was huge how, obviously. How was his impact today? Yeah amazing obviously and big three-run homer at the time I thought we were going to keep scoring so you didn't think that was going to be as you knew it was a big swing and you were excited for it but you knew we were going to get some more big swings and this game's crazy and the confidence factor and I try to stress to my guys how important it is that when we give a the pitcher confidence. The guy comes in a little, hey, these guys are swinging the bats good, and then they get some strikeouts, and they and they do it very simple, and they get they gain confidence, and then they, all of a sudden they're Nolan Ryan. So we gotta we gotta apply pressure and stay with it, you know. And defensively today, there are a couple really good moments, especially in that eighth inning, backing up Luke. How important is that for you guys collectively, just to put yeah, up we, a we, game we need it. You know, we in order for us to win, we gotta play clean baseball. Braden got was charged with a tough error on that one. It was an error that was an in-between hop, which ended up being a couple runs that inning. And then Tommy made some awesome ones. Savage made a great one. Uh, Braden made some good plays coming in. Yeah, so defense is huge. You know, the whole we, we gotta play we gotta play all facets. We're not good enough to play one part of the game and win, but we're good enough to beat anybody when we play the three, which we're capable of. Yeah, yeah, it was it's a crusher, but when you try to put things in perspective, it's like losing a three two heartbreaker. What is the difference? A loss is a loss. You're embarrassed and as a coach your ego gets in the way when you're dominated as, as a hitting coach when you're dominated by a pitcher, it's so deflating and you, you know what it's it's a loss is a loss. We could have scored ten runs yesterday and lost eleven to ten and it would have meant nothing. Today it's today and just like tomorrow, today's game means nothing going into tomorrow, but what a resilient group and great job by the staff to give us an opportunity to win today. And you know, you think about it too, on the road against a top five team in the country, really the opportunity to take the series tomorrow is what you're looking forward yeah, to, absolutely. right? Absolutely. You know, we obviously, you know, me, I want to be perfect always. So I, I want to come in here and get a sweep. So when you get your butt kicked, there goes the sweep. But the goal is still to win the big series. And that's so we, that's in our hands tomorrow. They've got Osmond going, uh, their third guy who's been really hot also. So we got our work cut out, but we can't wait for the challenge. For uh, Riley, yesterday was it something specific going wrong or do you think it was just one of those nights where you just one of those nights the wind will play some it can play some havoc on your mind but the problem is when it's like that you gotta say i may give up some cheap homers like marcelo did a cheap one down the line but i i can't give free bases and i gotta jump ahead and, and unfortunately riley you know shoot he's been so great for us and he had a tough one and that's just part of it and part of being a good team is you pick each other up and that's what marcelo did to to riley but he, riley's been awesome and i can't wait for his next one yeah, I'm good. All right.